Hey, this is Guy Gosslack, president of My Digital Money. Hey, this is Wes Huber, crypto analyst at My Digital Money. Yeah, uh, so Polygon is a layer two solution on top of Ethereum to essentially help developers more easily create decentralized applications on the Ethereum blockchain. Um, and it also helps those applications talk to each other. So it's interoperability and scaling on top of Ethereum. And, and those are some of the biggest challenges that Ethereum has, right? Ethereum is the most widely adopted framework for building decentralized applications. Um, and one of its biggest challenges is scaling, right? And so I, I think people are starting to realize that, you know, what value Polygon is actually bringing, it, it allows multiple options uh, for scaling and it, and it gives optional security and it makes it very easy to, to create decentralized applications with a few clicks of a button. So you don't have to be as technical. So it provides you a whole framework. Um, and as these applications are becoming a lot more, um, you know, it's understandable now by the larger community. Um, I think it's become more mainstream. Like there's consensus that these are valuable applications with all these NFTs coming out and all the, and all this metaverse adoption and, you know, decentralized lending and DeFi, you know, it's just kind of uh, Polygon is becoming pretty important. But it's like if you were developing, let's say, um, like a certain token, like a certain uh, NFT or a stable coin or, or something like that, then you can leverage it and you, you are developing it on, I don't know, Ethereum, um, then you could leverage it on a different blockchain. So then you can leverage that NFT across different applications, use it to pay maybe on a different network. Yeah, so there's multiple, so developers can more easily uh, create decentralized applications. So you can have two applications that can now talk to each other you know, two projects that can more easily talk to each other. Um, so if you were to create a specific uh, digital asset, you have a project that uh, monetizes a certain asset, maybe real estate, um, and then you have another application um, that does something completely different. Maybe it's a payment system or, or whatever it is. Um, so you would be able to exchange assets between the two and, and you know, actually transact between those two applications. Um, so what they're kind of suggesting is that Polygon is essentially an index fund of Ethereum. Um, it allows for scaling solutions um, and also helps with the reduction in cost efficiency of the high gas fees on Ethereum. But also there's a lot of different practical uses it, for it and it's been um, as Guy was stating, it's it's been used uh, a lot to date in, in just the building out of different D apps um, up currently to date, and I would say probably the majority of D apps are utilizing um, Polygon solutions to help kind of their inner frameworks build on how he was touching, um, utilizing different blockchains to gather data for different sources of payment solutions or just building out um, different um, different products within the, the blockchains. Um, so I think with Polygon gaining more traction from people and people understanding its uh, utilization and how it actually helps the ecosystem that's built on Ethereum, I think it's gonna start gaining more traction and people will ultimately help it keep its stability in the top 10 as, as you've seen it to this point.